Hello there, this is Carlo, and welcome to another quick tip tutorial. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how to export an OBJ file, um, whether it's a sequence or a standard model from Element 3D, so you can use it in uh, 3ds Max or Maya or um, any other 3D modeling program. So I'm just going to jump into my scene setup. Uh, I'm going to pick a jet strike model, so for instance this one, and I'm going to click OK. Now if we scroll down here in the um, settings, um, we've got a utility, so we're going to open that, and just here I have the ability to have a group export, so I can um, export all my groups um, which are in my um, uh, scene setup, or I can ex just uh, export one. So I'm going to click on group one, um, as my jet is on group one, and then I'm going to click on generate. I'm going to pick a point where I want to save it, so I'm just going to click on my desktop and I'm going to click Jet and click Save. And as you can see, my model is now exported. Done. Now, to test that out, what we're going to do is we're going to see that my model is here as an OBJ file. This is what I created in Element 3D. I'm going to come down to uh, 3ds Max. So we'll just open 3ds Max 2016 just to see how it's um, exported it. And we'll let that open. Okay, so 3ds Max is now open. So I'm just going to click out of here. If you hear any noise in the background, I've got two puppies that are playing at the moment. So I apologise about that. So I'm going to click on here, click on new. Uh, so I'm going to click on open. I'm going to go to the desktop and I'm going to show all files. I'm just go down to my OBJ, double click on that, um, and then I'm going to import every element for that uh, model. And as you can see, uh, my jet is now opened in. Um, 3ds Max, so let's click on realistic and now we can sort out our lighting, bits and bobs like that, um, just to fix our jets um, any way we see fit. So, yes, that is a quick tip. This is white um, for some reason, but we need to um, apply the textures to that. So, in order to do that, what you would do is you would go to um, where your models is. So, I'm going to go to my video co pilot. Um, let's go to uh, models. I'm going to jump into my jet dry maps. And I'm just going to make that a little bit larger. Um, I'm just going to scroll down to what it is if I can remember. Um, let's do this one. And then I'm simply just going to drag that on top of my model and just texture it um, as I see fit um, I can even add my own bits and pieces to it so I've just put the first texture on so uh, to give you an example so um, when you actually just quickly uh, render that out can. just go to um, set up As you can see, um, it needs a lot of work done to it, um, but as you can see, um, it's worked very, very well. So yeah, that's a quick tip for you guys, how to um, export uh, an OBJ uh, from um, Element 3D um, into another 3D mo modeling program, i.e. 3ds Max, Maya, Cinema 4D, so on and so on. So I hope this helped, uh, this tip's helped you, out, you guys out. Um, as always, uh, thanks for listening. Please remember to hit that like button and that subscribe button. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Ciao, ciao.